Hi guys, I'm Vinyl Motors and welcome back to another how-to video. Today we're going to be doing the wide body kit glitch. This was founded by B Nadell. Uh, so make sure you go check out his Instagram, his Twitter and his YouTube below. Especially his Instagram. First thing you need to do is get two cars and two people. For this video we've got the Karuma and the Banshee. The Karuma will be the primary car, so you'll see most of that. And the wide body will be from the Banshee. So the first thing you need to do is take out the doors on the Banshee. So we have got new pop here. He's going to take out both of these doors for us. Okay, so now that the Banshee's got its doors removed, it will go into passive mode, or the person will go into passive mode. Now the Banshee's going to park where my Karuma is now. Uh, and basically, it's best for the person who is in the primary car to move so for example as soon as new cop there we go is there i'm gonna go inside and new cop will get out of the actual um banshee now whilst i line it up so it just needs me to be in a new cop you can leave your car It does take a little while to align the vehicle to get it perfect. So we can see that the lights are through. Just double check that your wheels aren't poking through at the back. You can see ever so slightly like the back tyre is coming out. However, you still want the front to be okay. So the left side is okay as well as the right side. So I'd say that's pretty much central, so let's get out. Now, the Banshee is no longer in passive mode. So, this makes the car look like it's got a wide body kit. It is great for snapmatics, and uh, it just looks awesome. I mean, the pros is, it looks amazing. The cons, you can't exactly drive it, however, it would be great for Benny to add this to his garage you know wider than body cars uh, race spec or you know track spec even it does look awesome so we're just going to head over to the rockstar editor now just to get some shots of this so then we can see what we can actually produce from here Okay, so now that we're in the Rockstar Editor, we're going to get a quick snap. So you just want to add a clip. Uh, the clip we recorded from before. So there we go. So there is the Karuma with a Banshee. A.K.A. the Karuma 900R. And you've got to admit, you have to admit that that just looks totally amazing. You cannot deny that that doesn't look nice. But yeah, that's pretty much how you do it, so a massive thank you to Beanadel for showing me how to do this. So thank you for watching, if it was helpful please leave a like and please subscribe and we'll see you again for more GTA content.